Hi, I'm Chase Moody, and welcome to Ask a Dev. Our question today comes from Ashley, and she'd like to know, what are the big differences between Node.js and client-side JavaScript? Thanks for the question. There are a lot of differences, but for beginners, the basic thing to remember is it's the same JavaScript you've been using for years, minus all the browser APIs like the DOM. Both are single-threaded and event-driven, but Node.js is focused a lot more on input-output interactions. This is why it's great for building things like a backend API for your single page applications. Once you start down that path, you will start to realize the benefits of shared JavaScript between the server and the front end, while also doing away with the annoyance of context switching. If you've ever worked on a WordPress site, you know how painful that can be. Node.js also gives you the ability to interact with the file system. This is very different than your normal client-side JavaScript in that you now have the ability to read, write, and perform other actions on the server. This can also be beneficial with the Internet of Things. You can now build out JavaScript applications that can interface with the world around you. Although this can be very complicated, requiring a knowledge of C and C++ libraries, you can utilize a lot of great work that others have done through the Node Package Manager, or NPM for short. NPM is incredibly active, and if you are looking for something, there's a very good chance it exists on there. That's all for this episode. Tweet your questions with hashtag AskADev or just leave them in the comments.